Hi guys, welcome to my another YouTube video. And in this video, I'll be telling you my complete roadmap, how I went from zero to hundred plus talk. Uh, currently, I am on my one hundred fourteen talk. So in this video, I'll be telling you how I started my community, how we went from zero to hundred plus talks, and how it helped me in my growth and networking with different people and also many more things which we'll be covering in this video so without any ado let's just check how we did this uh so guys i know this is one of the topic you actually wanted me to speak on and i came across many people asking me like how you started your community and how you actually uh, go on from 0 to 100 plus talks in an year now it's more than year because i started in october 2020 and uh, probably it's going really great so firstly i'll be telling you the benefits of having a community whether it's a marketing community whether it's a design community or any community but the basic steps of starting a community is uh, probably same so community really helps you to network with like minded people and they actually help you to uh, make that collaboration thing on a next level because you get to know so many people like like minded people for which you can actually collaborate in various uh, projects or even have a freelance project and can hire them as uh, a second person and can ask them to uh probably join you in that freelance project uh third point is like it helps you to network with industry experts like i probably have invited more than 80 plus industry experts from various companies like amazon flipkart nike and microsoft and you can see there are other companies as in like olx misho walmart there are so many companies and i have covered uh, not only indian like uh, not only experts from india i have also invited from across the globe you can say from australia singapore morocco and even from i guess uh, california and uh, there are other countries as well i have invited so uh, i have actually crossed some of the countries even nigeria also i guess i remember i called uh, hakim so i'll be telling you how i started and how was my initial journey while building the community and now how it helped me to grow as a person as a designer and how it will be in future so i'll be telling you the future aspect of this uh, designly as well so i'll be creating the part 2 of this uh, version in which i'll be showing the complete new transformation so stay tuned and uh, yeah let's just start so for the first part i'll be telling how i actually started so it was just a random day and i was surfing through linkedin so i came across a person named as vishal sir i actually um, call them and mean uh, my sir because he actually changed the concept of community building for me and he came across with the thing that uh, why not you just start with a uh, building design community because i was at that time learning uh, under design and even now also i'm learning into design so he wanted me to take talks on like designing call design expert from industry were into uh, designing from say last uh, probably 10 years 15 years even 5 years so uh, i gave a thought on that ki uh, will it benefit me will it be good for me if i actually uh devote my time towards this thing so will it help me so the answer to everything was yes because it will help me to network with industry experts like they are the people who are working in great companies so it will definitely help me in internship jobs even for freelance project or even just a network with a specific person can actually help you in reference and it actually did as well so i started with a thought so probably i didn't enter just like that for this also i gave an interview like a entry sort of thing because 
for this also only 10 people are selected for the specific uh, role like the public speaking role because you have to be confident enough ki you can handle the crowd and you can handle the audience and industry expert you have invited as a guest so i just uh, said yes and i was very nervous at that time ki how i'll find industry expert and it is probably a difficult uh, task for me because that time I was a beginner and I just started in designing but just like that I uh, slowly and steadily go with the flow the other host as well helped me a lot and even we are as a, a community as well like another host communities so they help me grow See how you can start uh, reaching out to people. Then I formed a professional message. And I actually send them every weekend. So probably in the starting year, it was very difficult to call uh, speakers because sometimes they are just uh, clueless ki uh, we should go with that or not. Because that time it was just a certain and, and the uh, recent idea I uh, dropped. So uh, that person is very uh, confused or you can say he probably says ki no we are busy we are busy with some work. So I actually faced many rejections at the initial point of my community building but I actually have this courage in my mind ki no I have to uh, bring amazing industry experts so that they can tell my community audience or members ki how I actually think works under design. So I gradually started and I gradually get the hang on the like the proper procedure and all. So I actually uh, text a person and then ask him or her to get on a call for say 10 to 15 minutes so that we can have a chat or you can say I'll probably explain him or her a proper concept thing. So after that... Uh, that person agrees for the uh, session or for uh, like bringing bringing that person on a uh, like platform and he or she agrees ki yes i am ready to uh, devote my time and efforts for this community so this is how i gradually started from say 0 to 10 when i uh, reached to 10 talks i know that was just a over the top thing for me ki wow i did it for like say 10 talks only but Slowly and gradually, I never give up and I um, go with the flow. And then now, uh, like I reached to 100 plus benchmark of the talks and I have completed so many. I have actually covered so many industry experts and how it, how it actually helped me. First is network. It actually helped me networking with so many industry experts, so many uh, design experts. And uh, I was like just over the top because these uh, networking part actually help you in your jobs internship freelance projects so even if you are stuck in between it will definitely help you so i'll be making a separate video for the networking how it actually goes and you should start but yeah so it actually helped me with the job referrals as well i got a referral in hcl and even i started my freelancing journey through this uh, network there was a person who is a friend of my, one of the industry expert, and he offered me his personal project. So this is how I started and I worked under him. He was also from a design background. He helped me to understand the basic concepts of user flow, wireframe, IEM. I was literally clueless about everything. I didn't even knew about the invoice, keyword actually invoices. That person actually helped me in uh, creating the invoice key. Uh, you should uh, actually learn all this. But I started my journey from this uh, design, Lee, like from this community. Initially, the word or you can say the name design, Lee, also not given. So uh, while I was going through this journey, I thought why not just give a cool and sassy name to the community or you can say my uh, to be academy. So I thought, oh, why not just give it a designly name? So it was just a random thought. And uh, you can see uh, that like this is my Instagram page for designly. 
and I have mentioned what actually you will be getting. So it's a one-stop solution for all the design talks, boot camps, or even further things that are coming in future under Designly. And also I have completed 100 plus talks. I started on October 2020, like in October 2020, and now it's probably the Feb 2022. And you can see I have covered so, so many talks. I actually uh, took talks under different uh, topics like say portfolios, UX interviews, automotive sector. Even I actually take my solo sessions as well. I actually impart my personal knowledge to community uh, while I was learning through all this. Even effective, effective surveys, dark patterns, designing for UX career, UX metrics, even HTML, CSS basics. And there are so, so many talks. Even I was, uh, I thought to design a certificate for my speakers who actually devote their time and efforts. So I actually started with um, like appreciating every, dis uh, like every expert with my uh, certificate. Though probably in future, I'll be doing more for them because they help me uh build this whole community so there are so so many talks and you can see i have invited people from uh MC, like from companies like olx from you can say intern shala and there are so many companies from ola from michael from amazon he's a person from uh, amazon like he worked in amazon also and an academy also there is a person for, from Cars24 uh, and Puneet sir also I have invited who is a founder of Design Wings. Also, I invited Garima. Garima, she was working at Infosys that time, but now she's working at EY and I guess Microsoft probably. But yeah, I actually thought of starting this community a lot uh, after a lot of time, but yeah. This is the whole brand presentation of the community. I even started my uh, YouTube channel, as you can know. And also I have updated with other social links like Telegram also. And even I'm planning for Facebook page. So this is the part two, which I actually learned. And in the part three, I'll be telling the future of Designly. So I thought, why not... Uh, start with a proper academy thing though i'll be coming with a separate video and we'll be telling you about each and everything of what actually under that academy or probably the online academy uh will cover so but the future of this thing is i'll be uh, making a complete digitalized platform for you guys on which you can learn about design, how you can solve problem statements, how uh, like there will be boot camps, there will be weekly industry expert sessions, and even there are so many things. But yeah, also there will be uh, the area where uh, where I will be attaching the freelance gig part. Uh, so under just a sneak peek of this, under that I'll be mentioning the freelance projects which I get. So probably you get a chance to work with me or probably I can give you that project to you and uh, can have you on board for the same. But yeah, also I am actually uh, deciding to make a complete uh, design community, but not only for designers, there are things for non-designers as well. So uh, we want to learn and we want to upgrade or upskill themselves. And even there are, uh, there is another secret uh, package for the one who love fashion, styling and all. So that is just a little bit sneak peek of future of Designly. But I'll be making a separate video for the same. So uh, this is all for this video. See how I went from, from zero talks to 100 plus talks. You just have to keep a little patience and everything will uh, go with the flow and everything will come at a right place when it's actually moving with a flow you just have